Dusk in the village of Farako. School ended many hours ago, but the children don't want to go home. This is where they can comfortably get their homework done in the evening. The village doesn't have any electricity, but the school now has these lights. They were installed here just recently. We are very happy that we have lights now. We can study here, and after dinner, we can come back here to play. <laughs> the energy for the school comes from solar power. Engineer Makan Tandina is responsible for the project. After studying in France, he decided to bring his expertise back home. He could have taken his career a long way in Europe, but he's happy to be back in Mali. This is my baby. Even if I didn't finance it, it's my baby. I'm so excited that this project succeeded and that I was involved from the beginning to the end. Every time I see it, I'm really happy. I feel my time on this earth was worthwhile. Makan has to regularly check the system to ensure that it works properly. His first major contract came from the local municipality. This school has a small solar power substation that keeps the lights on. The energy from the sun is stored in these batteries. It's a huge advance for the poverty-stricken village. After making sure everything is in order, Tandina heads back to the capital, Bamako. It takes him half a day to get there. Today he's lucky the ferry is fully operational. The day when the solar power plant was delivered was a different matter. The last time we came to install the equipment, we had to use canoes and then bring them back. It took us a long time and was really tiring. But that's part of our work. We are rural people and it's not easy to get to the remote villages. Makan comes from Timbuktu in northern Mali. He understands very well potential benefits of the scorching sun. At his office, he's always busy talking to suppliers, writing quotes, and discussing his latest projects with business contacts. His phone is never quiet. Energy is life. It's a source of life. It's important, like water or light. Life here in Farako has drastically changed. The extra study time in the evenings has started to pay off. In their last exams, the students here had the highest grades in the whole community.